Well, northern leopard frogs are a very handsome frog, I think. Yeah, I think, I think anyone can develop an appreciation for frogs. Do you have her mic? My name is Leah Randall, and I work for the Centre for Conservation Research at the Calgary Zoo, and I study northern leopard frogs. I'm a population ecologist, so my goal is really to get a better understanding of what the population dynamics are in southern Alberta. So, frogs in general are considered to be a really important indicator species of, uh, for water quality. Um, but also in Alberta, one of the major concerns is with um, climate change. We're seeing increasing uh, warmth, but also drying, which for amphibians could be really problematic. Um, we had um, extreme droughts back in the 1970s, and that probably had a large impact on northern leopard frog populations at the time. So as far as why you should care, um, I think frogs are just amazing, and I would like to see, you know, um, everyone's children, I think, should get a chance to enjoy them. So typically what we do is um, we do uh, time-constrained visual surveys, which means we just walk along a wetland. Most of my research is completely non-invasive, which if you're studying a species at risk, the last thing you want to do is, is injure them, right? So we'll walk along a wetland and we uh, count frogs, we get an idea of what the different age classes are. But in Alberta, they're considered threatened, so they're, they're a species at risk. There's still some pretty good, healthy populations of leopard frogs in Alberta, which is great because it, it really gives us an opportunity. So um, we can use some of these remaining hotbeds of areas um, and move frogs to locations where maybe they've been extirpated, become extinct in those areas. Whereas in British Columbia, there, there, it got so bad that there was only one remaining population of northern leopard frogs in the Creston Valley. And so once, once the populations decline to that point, it's really hard to bring them back. So I think in Alberta, we still have an opportunity to save northern leopard frogs. So while the situation might be a bit dire, it's not hopeless. <laughs>